thrift haul today. This is a collection of things I've thrifted over the past few months and something that I bought on Poshmark. And so I will start off with the most exciting thing um, in the haul. This is the bag I ordered on Poshmark. It is Liz Claymore and I'm obsessed with it. I can't believe how amazing the quality it is. Um, all of the zippered pockets are red inside and it just has so many freaking pockets. And all of these, I love it. I think it's so cute. I'm so happy with it. I used to have a triangle shaped backpack that I loved but it was from Urban Outfitters and it um, broke irreparably so I'm excited to have this back in my wardrobe. The next few items my uh, creative partner Jill and I shot for a back to school uh, photo shoot and so I will show the photos of those items. I have this long nightgown. It's um, been pretty popular lately to wear nightgowns as dresses out and this was so cute for the shoot and I love it. I love this shade of green. This is definitely one of my colors and I'll put a picture of the shoot in. Next I have this silk button down blouse. This is definitely an essential piece. This is definitely an essential piece that will be really versatile. Oh, I think I have it buttoned wrong. But this was also featured in the shoot that we did. Next I have what I call the Lizzie McGuire mom skirt. <laughs> it really reminds me of the types of things they would wear and maybe like Mary Kate and Ashley kind of. And I love this. I'm so happy with this find. Just another really versatile piece. So I was thrifting with Jill and she showed me this jacket and it was marked as $12.99 and I think that that's a lot for something found at the thrift store but I tried it on and I just absolutely had to have it. It is the perfect 70s vibe jacket. It's just beautiful. And this was featured in a recent shoot as well. I've been trying to go to the gym more so I've been looking for athletic clothes at the thrift store and I found these and they have the nice little undershorts to keep you kind of secure and I was recently home at my parents and I wore these like every day. They're so comfortable. Very good find. I also got this cute little crop top that I have a like skirt that's the same color that I wear it with to create kind of a matching separate effect but I bought them separately. Alright, I found these clogs and they are so cute and I love how they look on but they're a little broken and I've I'm trying to fix them and I'm not sure if it was entirely effective. Basically the top part of the clog is separating from the bottom part and so I've tried to fix it with shoe glue a few times. Sorry about the noises outside, it's way too hot to have the windows closed and I guess there's just a lot of activity out there today. But anyway, love the clogs and I hope that I can make them work because this is a piece that I've been wanting to have in my wardrobe for a while. Next I have two purses. I um, found this little coin purse for like $1.99 at the thrift store. I really like the rainbow, obviously, on the bag and I just thought it was really cute and it's vintage and I wanted to take it home with me. I'm really excited about this bag. This is a guest bag. I um, was looking for like a red little small bag to take for going out and I looked through all of the purses and I could not find it and on the way out I was like maybe I'll just look one more in the back of the purse racks and I found this and I love the shape. It's giving me Fendi vibes. It's perfect. I love it. Very cute piece. I said that the backpack was the most exciting piece. These next two dresses may be even more exciting than that. I got them both at uh, the thrift store and they just give me very goth princess vibes. Winona Ryder-esque. This one is by Esprit. East Spirit. I never know how to say that, but that brand. And then this one with a little, with a higher neck 
and pleating on the front and then ties on the back. And both of these I would wear with Doc Martens or with like little lacy socks and um, some heels. And I'm really excited about them. I'm excited that it's getting maybe a little bit cooler even though I love the summer because I can wear these. So that is everything. Make sure to follow Jill Wave on Instagram and then me on Instagram at melancholy underscore molly if you aren't already. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day. Bye!